in our last video, we had created the gallery page, but uh, it didn't, the image didn't show up. And the reason was because I had this extra space here um, in, in my code, okay, in my file path. So I deleted it and then I saved it, file save. And then I am going to go check to see if that will work now. So refresh and there we go. Okay, so um, we can continue to add more images. Um, here I have in my images folder, you're only allowed to add, um, you're only allowed to add JPEGs, GIFs, and PNG. But I had purposely in my folder that I gave you, I had purposely gave you some files that are not um, GIF or PNG, okay? So, um, this is a WebP extension, this red chair and white chair. So let's go see what happens when I upload them, okay? So I'm gonna go back and up, try and upload them. So go to upload, uh, sorry, upload form.php. So I'm gonna choose file and I'm gonna upload C red chair and upload it. Okay, it says only JPEG, uh, PNG, and GIF files are allowed. So it says, sorry, your file was not uploaded. However, the record was still successfully added to my database table. Okay, so what happened here is, in here, in my database table, okay, I'm just going to go browse. It was C red chair was added. Okay, the name of the table was added when I clicked upload. However, in my WAMP folder, boss WAMP, in my uploads folder, it never got uploaded. Okay, the C red chair never got uploaded. So when I go look at my gallery page now, it's going to have this. Okay, so so what can we do about that? So what we can do about that is um, we can go into our code and change things around so that it doesn't get entered into the database, into our images database uh, table, if it is not a JPEG or a PNG or a GIF. Okay, so let's go into the upload.php. Okay, so right now, um, it will be uploaded if, um, you know, as long as there's a connection and then you click upload, the name of the file will be uploaded. So this is the attempt to insert the, the file name. So I'm going to take this out. So select. So from 18 to 24, the attempt to insert. I'm going to move that cut. Okay. And then I am going to go to where? Um, it checks for the file formats. There we go. So if the file formats is not, file type is not JPEG, it's not PNG, it's not JPEG, and it's not GIF, then say sorry, only JPEG JPEG, ping, and GIF files are allowed. Okay, and then I can else add else. So if it is, then, okay, enter, and then right click, paste, then insert the query execution. So insert into the images table, the name column, this file name. Okay, and then say the record was successfully added to the database table. Okay, so this insertion will only happen if the file type is correct. So let's go save that now. All right. Okay, so if you want to pause your video for a second to take a look at my code, uh, you can do that right now. And uh, please note that I have a open curly bracket here. 
and then a closed curly bracket here for this else statement, okay? And inside of this open curly bracket and closed curly bracket is where I had cut and pasted this code that was up here before, okay? All right, so I'm gonna save that. Okay, it's already saved. Then I'm gonna go over here to upload form, okay? All right. And then I'm actually gonna, before I do that, I'm actually gonna go over here to red chair, the second line. I'm gonna delete that because I don't want that in there. All right. Okay, so now again, I only have the Columbus chair, lounge chair, birch. So let's just hop over to gallery and see how that looks right now. Okay, so that looks good. No broken links to an image there. Okay, so let's hop back to upload form again. All right, so I'm gonna choose file and I'm gonna select the red chair again open it okay and upload image so file is an image okay sorry only jpeg png and gif files are allowed sorry your file was not uploaded let's go see the gallery so the file was not uploaded you don't have a broken image okay and here we go you can again look and refresh your table here and you can see that it did not the file name did not get entered here because I had moved that code block to into the else statement okay um, we can try it again we can keep trying another one so the other one here is also white chair is also not the right file format so it's also a webp okay so let's try uploading that as well I'm going to go to upload forms. Okay, upload, actually, it's just upload form, not forms. Go choose file, white chair. Okay, C gallery did not get uploaded. Okay, check my table here. Again, did not get uploaded, which is great. Okay, and then let's go to upload forms again, form again, upload form. Okay, now let's choose the Tribune mod model chair, modern chair. That one was successfully uploaded. There we go. Let's go upload again. I'm thinking I should have a upload, a link to my upload form page. Here we go, upload again. And here we have it. And that one was a proper format, so it uploaded. Oh, I have to choose. Upload again. Oh, I had uploaded this twice. Okay, and upload again. Okay, here we go. All right, and there you have it. So um, I would like you to practice this on your boss at home website. Um, make sure that it, uh, it works. Uh, make sure that you change the code. So there are a few things that you have to change yourself, which is, um, you know, how the gallery page mainly, you have to change the code so that you know you are displaying uh, everything in a division in a div tag instead of a table tag like your products page so you know use the code from the products page but then modify it so that you are showing everything in a div tag okay instead of a table and as well um, that you're showing everything in an image and you create a 
class in 